Hey guys, how's it going? So it's finally May 19th, and I'm really excited to do a reveal of the new Taurus pistol. And this is the GX4. Let's take a quick look here and see what's going on. This is actually a really neat little gun, and I think you guys are really going to like it. Now, this is just going to be a reveal video, and I did record a 28-minute review just the other day. YouTube restricted that review. I appealed it, and it's awaiting manual review. So we're just going to do a little reveal right now. Stay tuned on this channel for a really nice, thorough, initial unboxing and review while Susan and company try to get their act together. So we'll see what happens there. Now, for my Patreon supporters and channel members, I'm making the main video available right now. So make sure you go check over there for the link to it and you guys will watch right now but i'm just getting sick and tired of playing their games guys but i'm really excited to show this pistol to you so what do we have here this is literally an all new design from taurus guys this is a micro compact nine millimeter and it's going to be in about the same size as your seg 365 and your springfield hellcat three inch barrel only one inch wide so very narrow handgun about six inches long 4.4 inches tall and it weighs less than 19 ounces now when i did my initial video a couple days ago a lot of you said well this is just another glock i assure you guys this is not a glock and the only thing it actually has in common with glock's design really is right here and right here and the fact that it has the modified browning action and its striker fire but that's how most pistols are now this has styling as you can see right away of the Taurus TX-22 and it's a really sharp look. What do you guys think of that? It's going to move it around for you to take a couple quick peeks. But this is also not just a 9mm version of the TX. It's actually built completely different. Now this does feed from a double stack, single feed, 11 round magazine. Comes with two mags. They're going to have a 13 available soon, but as of right this minute, they're shipping it with 211. So it's going to be a flush fit mag. Now, as with most of the Tauruses in recent years, the second I grab this pistol, it literally just fits my hand uh, like a glove. Plenty enough beaver tail. It just fits perfect. What else can I say? Very comfortable. This has an all new grip texture, which is not too aggressive, but like the tighter you squeeze it, the better grip. You actually get show you guys a couple things this is just a very quick reveal we're gonna go through a, a thorough review on this channel very soon guys I promise so take a look there you can see they've chamfered the slide for easy holstering this is a concealed carry pistol now look at how sleek this is these are a couple things that are really cool you'll notice there's no more Glock style takedown latches instead there's a pen that just gets rotated easily with a piece of brass or a small screwdriver so that's a big plus totally snag free over here and check it out just a small little slide stop slide catch and no manual safety which a lot of people have said if Taurus would come out with a modern striker fired gun with no manual safety that they'd buy it so I think that's gonna get a lot of you excited of course it still has three safeties it has the drop safety or striker block built into the slide. It has the loaded chamber indicator right there, that little port in the rear of the chamber hood. And it also has the trigger blade safety. One more thing. This looks like a polymer framed handgun and it kind of is, but it actually kind of isn't. Because this gun has a complete internal stainless steel subframe, otherwise known as a chassis. So it has rails going all the way down from end to end and all of the bearing surfaces of the slide where it reciprocates back and forth is on this metal subframe that incorporates the trigger etc in fact you can see the window to the stainless subframe right there so this is literally a new pistol and I really think Taurus did an awesome job with this the trigger it's single action only. It does not have the restrike, and that may bump some of you guys out, but I'm overall very pleased with this trigger. I'm just going to show you guys real quick here the pull. There's just a little bit of take up. You feel it hit a wall right there, and it breaks. See how little the travel is? You can already see right now this is an all new design trigger that's totally different than the previous G series. So, with it being single action, let's look at the reset. 
And you guys are really going to like this. Check this out. Right there. Back into that single action trigger pull. Look guys, this pistol is very, very robust. I'm going to do plenty more videos with it, including the review that I've already recorded. I'm going to do many more things. Comparisons, contrasts. I think you guys are going to be impressed. This thing is like, just check this out. One more teaser. Talking about that internal subframe. I'm reefing on this thing almost as hard as I can. And there's like literally basically no play in the front whatsoever. Normally you'll see, because this isn't just a polymer frame with a couple little pins through it, this is a complete chassis. Look, there's no pins going through there. This thing's pretty cool. Other little things you might like. The barrel is black, which looks sharp, and this is DLC, diamond light carbon coating on it. Look, there's way more that I've already talked about in my review. And as soon as YouTube's done playing games with me, you'll all get to see it. And look, the only reason I'm not showing it is I could care less about making money off of it. It's not just that it's demonetized. They put restrictions on the video. The last time I posted a restricted video, I still have people a month later asking me why I didn't do that video. And I actually did because they warn you up front that they're not going to show it to anyone. So... Hopefully the suspense is over. I think you guys are going to be very, very happy with this. And by the way, Taurus was very nice. Due to a bunch of my viewers, you guys, asking them to get this channel more involved. And they did send this pistol just for me to borrow to do the review. They're not paying me for the review. In fact, I'm not even getting the gun for free. I can buy it when I'm done reviewing it or I can just send it back to them. Hint. I'm going to buy one because this thing's totally awesome. Stay tuned for my review that might be up tomorrow. If not, probably the next day. Patreon supporters, channel members, make sure you head over there to my community section and my Patreon page. And you guys can see the full video right now. Taurus GX4 9mm. Totally loving it, guys. All right. Thanks for watching and have a good one.